Now we're going back to some hardcore. Yep. Thank you, Anne. Thank you very much cool. for letting us jam, yeah? We normally do that at home, yeah? Yeah. This one's called Final Judgment. Facts of Fury. Facts of Fury. Facts of Fury. Facts of Fury. Here we go. Facts of Fury. Woo! Mark, you know where I'm at? I'm a living in Fortress Europe and the fascists are coming. Gone are the days when the blacks are running. Back in the days in my motherland, we accept the mission that was with the open hands. Centuries late, up. Oh, I'm living in the freezer working for some redneck pop belly bitch. Who constantly smokes and broke his soul, I hope he chokes. Why the telling his black jokes? But I'm cool for good mental health. History will always repeat itself. For your nation's problems, we stand to choose. The same way the Nazis blame the arms the Jews. TV news portrays as a whole the modern African image of some nigga with a begging bowl. I would have stopped machine killing his brother like the tongue. Since guy did too many other to my contemporaries. I have the living content. Far white tongue is sprung out of that temp. Still temp when I vent, cause surely a lyrical sinner from physical style, the facts of fury. Facts of fury. Facts of fury. The black facts of fury. Facts of fury. Oh, kill him, man! Back to Fury! Back to Fury! Woo. Back to Fury! Back to Fury! Here we go, here we go! Some singers, they maintain the status quo And not the black back and singers all just like hoes Going, uh, uh, uh Still getting kicky and trying to play Marvin Gaye And even with some... Making the funk punks are far too long no. Your lyrics are weak, but your voice is still strong no. Misuse your talents to sing those songs You don't relate to your people, you relate to your freedom Sing songs of facts so all can understand Extend your repertoire like the man Rashad is bad, but I'm glad that he made it. The wickedest album though it never got paid Most singers pretend, but we intend The soul should be slow with a D in You misuse your gift when it can really uplift your people Stuck in the love shit, when I riff and fit The draw of the artistic be rich, but constantly poor Judged by your actions that don't ignore Lyrical, cynical, physical, the facts of fury Facts of fury, facts of fury The black facts of fury Facts of fury, the black facts of fury, facts of fury. Facts of fury. Oh yeah the black facts of fury. Facts of fury. Facts of fury. The black facts of fury. Facts of fury. Facts of fury. DJ kill on the wheels of steel. Facts of fury. And gay on the vocals. Mad Margot. Producer. Extraordinaire. Ashley on the drums. Hunt Kilberry Finn on the rap. Mad Marga from Catch 22 saying tune in to Third Eye. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Oh yeah. Alright. Woo! You want some more funky shit? Just they rocking with the funk. See? They want funk, man. That's what they want. They want funk? Yeah. Well, we know you're funky. Oh yeah. This is the man himself. This is DJ Marga. Mad Marga. Producer star. Check this out. Inner, what could reverse? New lyrics have burst. Free of the shackles that had me immersed in a train of thought that has held me back. Imagine if white was black. A white boy's on the train, he ain't no crook. But other blacks give him dirty looks. Wrap their bags and hold their purses. Under their breath, there's racial curses. But it's rehearsed. He holds the grudge. To a black judge, justice will never budge. But under pressure, he must conform to other white boys. He's considered abnormal. He sold his soul to gain the curse. Is this the truth of the world or a world called reverse? Here you go. Woo! In a world called reverse. Yeah. In a place. In a world called reverse, new vibes I found. He's the change that had had me bound. In a train of thought that was doomed to fail. Imagine men no longer men. Oh damn, there's a man. He's a rat of the office. But tell me. How can we stop this? Sitting alone on the train and he's frightened Cause the women think he's tightened Trousers arise with thoughts of rape And then she'll say He aren't free, right? While on the place some men are unclean You're wearing a white string vest just posing in a magazine And they're seen in clubs men whining, grinding, dining Still undermining each other But who could be the first? 
to sit for inequality. <laughs> but for press. This is Hung Finn, reporting for Third Eye Magazine, the original Bad Boy Magazine. Here we are sitting here with um, Byron, the proprietor, editor, writer, distributor of Ear to the Ground Magazine. Tell me, why did you start the magazine? Basically, um, I did an interview with an artist called Blade, you might have heard of him. Basically what happened was I wanted to take, sell this article to a magazine, but no one was interested in buying it. So I came up with the idea of actually putting together some more articles and that. Um, went up north to visit my uncle, basically laid out the magazine up at my uncle's with his help and that. And then I had a magazine, took it to a printer's and then he printed it. It was as simple as that. But it was basically the reason why I set up the magazine was because people didn't want to buy my, my article. That was why. And then it took off, so I continued doing it. What do you think of the magazines that are available right now? But I just think the editorial teams on certain magazines don't really understand what I'm into anyway, hip hop. So they end up Such sort of as like. Any example? I'm not going to give any examples because then I could be cutting off sort of like opportunities for work later on in my life and that. But I think people know who I'm talking of. Like you're going to get articles on heavy metal, you know, how fat a rapper is or something like that. And it just doesn't make sense to sort of like see people talking about that and they're not talking about what's happening over here, do you know what I mean? I mean, because you can, you could even make a point of talking about the fact that, you know, artists here aren't selling or whatever, do you know what I mean? But no one seems to make a point of doing it. That's, that's interesting in itself. People out there won't necessarily share my taste in music. And what I will try and do, regardless of whether I like an artist's music or not, I will interview them and represent them. Because at the end of the day, in this country anyway, a lot of DJs, decide who DJs. should be represented. How do you mean? Radio DJs? Radio DJs, yeah. A lot of radio DJs decide who's who should be represented and who shouldn't, do you know what I mean? And I think, at the end of the day, that's wrong. Basically, um, 